CBS 4 News team live coverage takes us outside now and CBS 4's Carrie Codd. And he's live tonight in Davie where several neighborhoods are flooded. Carrie. That's right, Ruta Bay and Rick. The entrance to Sunshine Village Mobile Home Park and Western Hills Mobile Home Park along State Road 84 near Flamingo Road is shut down right here. You can see the barricade in the front of your view. Water all over the roads the, today, this afternoon. Now, the water has receded significantly. If you look, however, down where you see a bunch of orange cones just further afield, that area there is where there is a canal inside this mobile home park. We are told that that canal overflowed, sending water all over the streets here. It was enough to get the Red Cross out here to do an assessment. I just got off the phone with them. They told me at this point they don't think anyone is going to be displaced, but they are on high alert. Days of heavy rains left a mess all over Broward County. Flooded streets and parking lots, stranded residents, and rising water levels in canals. It's insane. I've lived in Florida for 20 years. I've never seen anything like this before. We heard that time and time again. I've never seen it like this. More flooding than I've ever seen. All anyone can do is wait for the rains to stop and the water levels to recede. In Plantation, canal water approached the tops of seawalls. At American Heritage near Sunrise, several feet of water covered the football field. In Coral Springs, this canal creeped into the backyards of homes, getting uncomfortably close. In Davie, mobile home parks along 595 quickly filled with water, like Sunshine Village, where a canal overflowed. This resident showed us how deep it is at his house. That's pretty deep. Yeah. Davy Public Works crews assessed the damage and blocked off roads, but were told one resident nearly drove into a culvert when he couldn't tell where the road ended. One of our residents pulled him out in a four wheel drive. It's life. There's nothing you can really do about it. Mother Nature comes in, you gotta deal with what happens. And as we have seen throughout the day today, people trying to navigate the streets in their cars here, of course, that's something that. Uh, emergency management officials remind folks not to do. Again, the Red Cross told us they have set up a reception center just a few blocks from where we are, closer to Flamingo Road, just south of State Road 84 here in the Davie area for people that do need assistance. And as Craig mentioned, with more bad weather expected in the next couple of hours, the Red Cross is watching this very closely in case people do need help. Live in Davie, Kerry Codd, CBS 4 News.